Something that's always impressed me is how you can start with zero information and quickly build situational awareness using the, the aircraft. We'll get a call on the radio to say, launch the VHR, and within 15 minutes we're in the air tracking towards their position. And the only two bits of information we need is where they are and a radio frequency to talk to them on, and we'll build the situational awareness en route. You can't do that with every aircraft. Without the systems we have on board, we couldn't do that. Tiger sits in a niche in between light attack or observation helicopters and uh, the heavy attack helicopters such as Apache uh, or, or its Russian counterparts. It's a lighter helicopter sitting at about six tonne. Uh, it makes it very uh, agile, but it also has uh, the, the full weapon systems that you can find on one of the heavier attack aircraft. Reconnaissance is a big part of what we do, but also we've now got the ability to prosecute targets and have a kinetic effect on an area as well. We've now got a sophisticated sensor, we've got weapon systems that can reach targets thousands of metres away. There's TV and thermal in there, so that gives me my all-weather capability as well. Uh, so now, even in the darkest conditions, I can see threats in the battle space kilometres away. That combined with the fact that there's a laser rangefinder designator in the site as well means I can designate a target and uh, we can quite quickly change the tide of, of that battle for the friendly force to ensure that we're bringing them out safely because that's another person down on the ground just like there is in the cockpit of the aircraft. We've all got families. Tiger was the first of a new generation of aircraft. It wasn't just a conglomeration of all those little bits and pieces of analogue aircraft we previously operated, it was far more than that. It was a step change. But the good news is um, this improvement in technology has definitely improved our ability to do our job. There's no doubt. Everyone knows that Tiger had a chequered introduction into service, but importantly, the, the message that people miss is the fact that in the last two to three years, we've, we've really turned a corner with ARH. So ARH is ready today, and the pilots are trained today to go and support our troops on operations, and we can do that by day, night, or weather conditions quite effectively. Now we've got to a place where we understand what can be delivered, we're now promoting it often and uh, an army is becoming more comfortable with that. Now I think it's part of the step change you're seeing this year in particular is everybody wants a piece of Tiger because Tiger is now delivering on the promise finally. And obviously that's, that's pretty important going into you know, next decade.